Hey beauties, it's your girl Tinker from Just a Touch Beauty Salon and Spa. Y'all know what time it is, right? It's Monday. 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 How y'all feeling about Monday? How y'all yeah, feeling? So today is motivational day. Now, wherever you want to place that to whatever day it is for you, you can do that. All right, but I just want to give you a few nuggets today. Something that you can dwell on. As it is in me right now, resting by God, the Holy Spirit, I will give it to you. All right, so I'm just going to say a quick prayer as we go into this. And I want to say thank you, Lord, for this great day. This blessed day. A day that we have never seen. A day that you give to us once again. Lord, we place it in your hands and we say, have your way. God, touch the lives of those who needs to be touched today by this word. Not by my strength, but by your Holy Spirit today. Let this word be spirit and life into the hearts of those who need it. God, we thank you. God, we give you praise. We give you honor. And I, I say, have your way. In Jesus' mighty name. Amen. All right, so I want to come from a place of letting you know, do not today let nothing hold you back. I want you to know that each time I come here to give you some type of motivation, know that it is inspired by the Holy Spirit. You may be facing trials as well as I may be going through, coming out of or going into. But however God leads and however he directs, this is how it's going to be. So I am going to come from a place of real, okay? Because we are in a real world today. No lie. And we face some serious stuff. We know time. Real stuff for us, especially as believers or people of light, to be slapping up with the enemy, okay? Now, I want to let you know that do not let anything hold you back. You all know that, like I said, for you who may be new, for those who already know me, who have already been here with me, who are here with me, you all know I'm a beautician first. But on top of that, I love the Lord. And God is first in my life. You understand? He is first in my life. Okay, so we don't have time in this season. To be playing with the enemy because the enemy ain't playing with us okay so i i want to be a place today so what i want you to know and what i'm what god is placing in my spirit and like i said i'm coming from from a place of real okay ain't nothing i shared on this oh i ain't experienced or have encountered or anything of that sort Okay, but listen, we are all overcomers through the blood of Jesus Christ. All right, we all have our tests, we all have our trials, we all have our journeys in life to go through. All right, so listen, this is the point that I want to give you today. Let nothing, when I say nothing, let nothing hold you back from creating the life. You understand that you have always wanted as entrepreneurs we are persons who are out there in the workplace wherever you want to put your, yourself but i always come from a point a place where i'm at i'm an entrepreneur and so i am a beautician okay we all have set goals we all have set dreams we all may have a vision in our head 
Okay, if you don't have a vision today in your head, please get one. All right, get one. Because that is the thing that's going to keep you and propel you to keep going forward. We got to keep moving. We can't allow anything to stop us. We can't allow anything to hold us back from that life that we want. From the life and the promises God has purpose and destined for our life. Let me tell you all something. The enemy ain't playing out there and he don't want y'all to come into some stuff. The things that God has set and purpose for your life. But let me tell you something today. Put that stuff together. Whatever dream you had set for your life. Listen, gather that back up. Go back to the books. Whatever it is you have, wherever you have written that down and bring that back to the forefront of your mind. Bring that back to fruition now. And listen, let's start working this thing. Real talk, real world out here. There are some things that just come up against us. Inside us, I get from the top. You understand? We have some of them things that come from the back. But let me tell you all something. If y'all know that y'all have somewhere that y'all going and all of these things are coming from you from the left, from the right, from the back, listen, if that throw you down to the ground, baby, get back up here, yeah? pick yourself back up, dust yourself off and keep going, keep moving, keep going forward in Jesus Christ's name. Keep your eyes on Jesus Christ. Keep it for front, center, front. Okay, tunnel vision. Put the blinders on, baby. Keep Put the blinders on. I'm sure that each and every one of you have a goal, have a dream, have a vision. And, and if you don't have one, set one. That is the thing that's going to keep you on the right path to that thing that you want it. Okay? Listen, I am telling you, do not let someone's opinion of you listen become your reality yeah do not and i repeat this do not let someone's opinion of you become your reality the devil and the mama is a liar and words can be very powerless if you don't pay attention to it if you don't give it no fuel words are very powerless some people allow words to hurt them some people allow words to break them but that's if you pay attention to it if you give way into it if you fuel that by giving thought to that tell y'all something words have no power if you don't give air to it it have no power you as an individual have the power you understand to allow certain things or reject certain things as god's children as children of light we have to know the power that exists within us we have to know the power that we have in jesus christ that we can be able to shut down the plans and the plots of the enemy today all right let me tell you all let me tell you all I could tell you all this because I live it, I experience it, and I know what it can do if you exercise it. If you people and things, listen, they don't walk in your shoe. So listen, don't give them no power to direct your parts. Do not give them no power to direct your part because they don't walk in your shoe. They don't know what you have to go through every day. They don't know what you have to face. They don't know what you have to deal with every day. You understand so don't give the power to nobody don't give the power to no thing don't give the power to no words that's the plot and the plan of the enemy today when you see those things come up against you you speak and say no weapon form against me shall prosper and every tongue that rise up against me be condemned in judgment in the mightiest name of Jesus you understand that's the power that we have in, in Jesus Christ and if you don't know him today get to know him yeah real talk that's the path that we on. All right? So, listen. If Keep anything it. is trying to hold you back, give it no attention. All right? Don't give no attention to it. Don't give no attention to it. Get your hopes 
up. Get your faith up. You understand? Look up. And get ready to rise up. Get ready to rise up. Lift your head up. Put a smile on your face, baby. Listen, you're a warrior. Be the light that God has created you to be. He never put you under a bushel. He wants you to shine, be in the open and shine forth. All right? Let nothing hold you back today. Don't be surprised if you outgrow certain people to become a better person. Okay? Let them hold you back from raising your standards. You're wanting to be a better person in life. There's nothing wrong with that, okay? There's nothing wrong with you trying and wanting to be a better person in life. People might try to dim your light, you know, because they see you rise and they see you trying to go somewhere. They see you, you know, being positive. They see you um, helping persons. They see you just wanting to become a better person, become a better you. You know, they try to snare your life. They try to um, pass blame on you. They try to drag you in the mud. Listen, listen to me, y'all, y'all. Take my advice. Don't let nothing pull you back. God wants you to be a light in your fear of society, whatever that is for you, okay? Whatever that is for you. On your job, as an entrepreneur, in the schools, you know, wherever it be the light. God has called you to be. The enemy don't want nothing more for you than to see the promises of God not be fulfilled in your life. And so he will try every way, every form, every shape to stop that from happening. All right? But God already came to give us a life so that we can have life more abundantly. And it's already ours. So we claim it in the name of it today. We claim it today. We claim what is rightfully ours. And I say... Do not let anything hold you back. Listen here, if you're new to this channel, please subscribe. Like I said, we are all about touching the lives and the needs of people inside out. Okay, so we do not only do hair, we do not all only do face. We motivate you, we inspire you to be a better person. You understand? And everything that you see or I talk about is real stuff. All right, so... Don't dim your light for nobody. Set your standards, raise your standard, and stick by your standards that you set in life. Okay? And that's straight across the board with whatever. Whatever. With persons, with things on the job, whoever. Okay? Your supervisor, your manager, your boss, your relationship, your auntie, your uncle, your daddy, your sister, your brother, your mother, all of them. Whatever it is. Wherever you want to put it. Place it there. All right? You are special. You are made in the image and in the likeness of God. And let nobody take that from you, okay? Don't let nothing hold you back. Get the thing, yeah? Go for it. Keep going. Keep pushing. Stay focused. Keep a tunnel vision. And keep your eyes on the master. All right? It's a girl, Tika, from Just a Touch, Beauty Salon, and Spa. Listen, I love you guys. And you can do a lick about it. Okay? Just out. Peace.